Hello guys, uh, I'm going to show you how to see the torrent in this video. First, uh, we need a web browser. And um, as you can see, um, I'm going to give you two different examples. First, let's go on uh, CG Peers. It's, an, uh, it's a website on uh, uh, computer graphics people and the community who uploads all the different uh, applications and tutorials uh, lots of uploads every day like other ones uh, one particular things that we are about to note uh, is uh, you can uh, see this uh, ratio which is written like uh, 0.33 for my count uh, this is my count uh, that's why I'm logged in and uh, it's showing me instantly that the ratio of sharing so I'm, uh, my ratio right now is uh, 33 to uh, 13 here and um, that means like I I am able to download up until my uh, required ratio reaches to 33 but uh, the point to note here is if I keep uploading which I'm uploading right now uh, so you can see seeding here I'm uploading these uh, torrents right now and uh, with this speed and uh, my ratio is always gonna go up see 14 gigabyte and uh, uploaded all throughout my uh, account creation from the day I created this account pardon my English and uh, downloaded that means uh, the amount of uh, files I've downloaded from this is uh, 44 gigs okay this is one and um, to upload something every website will have uh, some Im information uh, possibly frequently asked question section or some other department you just have to look around for CG peers uh, uh, the f uh, uploading process or method uh, appears right uh, how to create a torrent and upload it to CG peers and uh, there's the choice is that uh, how you're gonna upload uh, I'm using uTorrent so mm, assuming you're also using uTorrent but you could use other applications as well just uh, open uTorrent press control N regular stuff and just like follow everything uh, by their words uh, the difference uh, for private torrent site uh, which is this one um, will give you a tracking uh, address and the tracking URL uh, w has to be unique because uh, it always gonna record or bookkeep all the uh, uploading or downloading happening uh, throughout the seeded torrent uh, after you create how you create that uh, from where uh, it's pretty pretty straightforward uh, if, if you read that uh, completely up until the end but I'm just gonna like show you a demo quick demo it's an, I'm not gonna like actually upload anything new but uh, the process starts from uTorrent file create new torrent and you create it and then you go on uh, select the source you can add a file if that's a, like a file you, you can just like double click on that uh, but if it's a directory which I'm preferring right now because uh, uh, yesterday I was trying to upload something on CG peers and I converted everything on uh, RAR uh, extension that means I uh, zipped it so that like it shrinks in size and I tried to add that as a file and uh, upload but it didn't work um, the RAR didn't support it in CG peers I don't know it might work in some other sites but like there's some flaws with uh, RAR files I guess uh, but the safe practice is add a directory and you you just like I have like in in my documents I have like an upload set right there there's th there there's your upload set and um, suppose I'm gonna upload uh, how to be a rockstar freelancer and I'm just gonna select that folder that's gonna like go right up there I, this is like the trackers which you're gonna find it for C CG peers uh, here like if I'm gonna go on like upload now they're gonna like show me something here okay like it's a, like a random stuff like definitely nothing special 
and you just like uh, go on that one and like copy that one oops uh, not this one okay and you just paste that in here then for uh, private seeding which happens in CD peers you have to check this uh, private torrent checkbox right here and then you uh, uh, both uh, other ones like has to be ticked on rather it's like in a private seeding uh, site or if it's a public seeding site um, then you create and save as it's gonna create that in that folder wherever you just like want to like make it's gonna give you an option here's my options and what happens is uh, uh, they're gonna create that dot torrent file like this one or this one and after that you just like go again on that upload one and then uh, you choose the file and you just like select this one you give description title you add like an image if you want it's optional then you read everything you categorize that like in here you get got categorization option you take this one you upload the torrent but the uploading process should start right at this point when you just like created the torrent in the previous step uh, like when I'm gonna like create the torrent after selecting my fi fi uh, file or folder in my case definitely right at that second it should say seeding and uh, whatever name it has right there uh, for private trackers like private uh, seeding uh, a site uh, it always uh, it is always gonna be red uh, in the status bar initially after 12 or 10 minutes it's gonna be green because uh, every time you can see the tracker uh, bar here it, it, it is updating uh, constantly after a certain uh, period of time or interval so uh, whenever like the interval is uh, uh, switching from one to other uh, or resetting uh, th that's the proper way to say it uh, it's gonna convert itself in green that means it is uploading right now notice like no one's downloading my torrent right now because it's not uh, a pair it, it is not still uh, in the database it's not accepted uh, by CGPS right at that point but like uh, sooner or later one point you're gonna like see give it a little bit of time and you're gonna see that um, uh, it is gonna appear here my previous two torrents are, uh, has appeared right here uh, and uh, like this many people has already downloaded like leached or like snatched it like they just downloaded and like uh, hit and run and this many people are like uh, uploading and this many people are uh, downloading right now so uh, I am one of them uh, who uploaded but initially it was my upload that's how you're gonna like do that in CGPR so let's quickly talk about uh, uh, Pirates Bay how you're gonna uh, see that I am like I just made this tutorial based on like my troubleshooting because uh, first when I tried to like start seeding and I, I faced so many problems uh, and I tried to look everywhere for solution I couldn't find like perfect solution where where they're gonna like give you like the troubleshooting stuff so that you can just always overcome the problem okay in here you're just gonna upload it's, it's the pirate way it's like a very famous one of course like everybody knows that uh, in here we're gonna like go on um, preference or upload torrent either way you can just like go to that link upload torrent in here it's very fast you have to like feel everything very fast because like after certain period of time uh, this page is gonna uh, be dead that means Pirate Bay will reset this page to its initial state uh, which will not be dynamic at that point so whatever you have to do it you have to do it like within a minute or so uh, I don't know the exact time but I always like try to do that like in a minute or so you just like choose a file quickly whatever or folder whatever then that put the name categorize that uh, like if you want to be hidden you just like tick that you just put tags you just like uh, add image description and then like this is like a captcha mm, I'm a Bengali person that's why like it's uh, showing in Bangla here anyways like uh, then add add it to the in index then like it's gonna be added like uh, 
if I'm gonna go on my account and um, see there's like a, I already uploaded these two torrents right here and um, the f only thing is uh, required uh, here is like a cedars which it doesn't have right now but I'm not planning to seed it uh, up here I'm just gonna do some cleaning and so for some weird bug uh, I cannot just like remove these uh, two from Pirates Bay website but as soon as I'm gonna take care of that I'm gonna seed new torrents but uh, this is the way now first thing first like sometime let's go back to CG uh, peers sometime you're gonna upload your torrent and it's not gonna work it, it, it is not gonna seed and uh, there's gonna be like always zero uh, uh, only one seeder and it's not gonna be uh, downloadable by anyone else then there's g the people's gonna like give you lots of like uh, comments saying that like okay uh, this file is not like coming I'm just like uh, uh, downloading for that for a couple an hour um, couple of hours and like uh, still it's at 0.0% uh, uh, for downloading uh, which means like in here they're they're unable to download anything uh, stuff like that now uh, the question here is like how you can improve it so that like uh, it's a sure shot it's like a uh, perfectly uh, uploadable uh, uh, torrent for from your counterpart so anything like that people are complaining it's uploading it's saying uh, in your u-torrent it's seeding and everything and but it's always one here like this one the last one here uh, the other one like has like more than one right like it's 15 it's 49 but uh, if it stays in this condition forever that means like you have a problem although p it's uploading the people cannot download it's uploading to some like god knows where in the space but it's uploading not towards the user in that case you just like go to your uh, uploads you immediately delete that then you remove that that's a delete by the way. Oh, oh it's download sorry f um, pardon me it's like um, if you want to delete that you have to go inside that I assume yeah you have to go inside then you have to like, remove that okay so remove that and then like you have to uh, uh, r remove that from also here you remove and delete torrent data this is the case only when you're failing to see it properly and then you re-upload you create a new torrent the same one same directory whatever you did before the exact same procedure then you put this one you put like the uh, private trackers list if it's like a private tracker if it's a if it's pirate bay or if it's like um, any public tracker you just like don't have to put anything here and then you you tick untick whatever depending on what sort of like uh, uh, site it is you re-upload that then up until you get the result when other people are able to download your contents then that makes sure that uh, your torrent is okay other than that it's always gonna like uh, show you errors like uh, it's definitely not gonna show you errors here but definitely it's gonna give the people who are like took their time to download your stuff and like waiting so that it starts they're gonna start like complaining okay dude it's not like happening we cannot download stuff please re-upload or whatever well there's a basic problem for a newbie like me who faced in the beginning to upload a torrent for you guys you just you just like uh, uh, like try different methods in different ways there's so many different like torrent sites everyone has like a guideline there but for me I thought like a proper video tutorial for this sort of troubleshooting was required so I did this uh, hope it, it just uh, it, it helped you a bit um, so happy torrenting always remember to seed and share with other because uh, sharing is caring